Okay. Oh, here we go again. A bunch of useless bands that are just. So, if you are wondering, yes, I have his permission. He f agreed to letting me use his content. So we get to watch all of his videos. Are gonna watch this video, his newest video. And let's just watch it. So. I'm definitely gonna edit the out of this. Um, in case you're wondering, yes, he's very child friendly. He's a very good YouTuber. He gives you basic information on reptiles and amphibians, some amphibians. He even has burbs and dogs. I checked his Instagram, it's awesome. Follow him on Instagram, follow him on here. He's the best YouTuber, you will never regret it. Do it, or I will s never mind. Okay? If you're not following him, strange, strange human you are. Okay. Hold on, I need my co host to be right back. Also, if you heard me yell something questionable in the beginning, that was because Evan was hitting my mic with my with his pillow, and I yelled, what the, Evan, so, yeah, I did curse, censor that, if you did hear it, I'll be right back, with my co-host, Okay, I'm back, and Adam, I know you're going to be watching this, i send you the link to the video, um, and just for him, I'm going to do the, his intro, because he's the best. Welcome to Waylon Sargent. I'm Waylon, this is Leo, you can't see him, but he's the most cute thing ever. In honor of him. He is the best. I'm so happy I found his um, channel. Okay, let's continue. Wasting taxpayer dollars and accomplishing absolutely... Well, here we go again. A bunch of useless bands that are just wasting taxpayer dollars and accomplishing absolutely nothing. Are reptile bands completely useless? And what sort of regular... Video thanks to Adam Wicken. The best. Do we need in this hobby, if any at all? Today, let's talk about it. My name's Adam, and this is Diamond. You're watching Wicked's Wicked Reptiles. Stick around. And there he did it. Look, there's a Chinese cave. If you want to get the point of this video in a shorter, condensed version, this is the point I'm going to drive home. With no path to illegal. There will always be illegal ownership. Okay. Simple as that. That is why all bands on certain species, for example, do not work at all. If you are going to outlaw, say, tegus, like they're trying to do in South Carolina right now, and there's no way to legally get them, permit system, license, nothing like that, they're just, you cannot have If you're going to outlaw a reptile, there's going to be people illegal keeping them. I agree with Adam fully. You should at least make it so they have a permit to keep them. Have them, you are going to have illegal ownership. Period. And a main beef I have with bans on reptiles is the fact that the lawmakers 
don't actually know what they're talking about a lot of the time. And I'm not saying that lawmakers are idiots or stupid or anything like that. I'm not saying that at all. All I'm saying is that a lobbyist brings this to task, all of a sudden a bill passes, and it's not because they've done their research. And often it's not bans just on reptiles, but bans on things like shitting animals completely. I'm talking about in New York. Bill 4611 is banning the shipment or trying to ban the shipment of all animals. This is fish, this is livestock, no! this is reptiles, this is mammals. This is you go to your local reptile shop and they can no longer sell you animals because they can't have them shipped in. And even if they can get their hands on these animals, so what? Now they have to drive to go get them? What's the difference between them being shipped to you and FedEx driving them to you? Or are you going to... It makes absolutely zero sense whatsoever. There is no logic behind this. And if you're thinking, well, why would I listen to this guy who looks like Mr. Clean and wears Waldo and a baby? I totally get it. I understand. But think for yourself and do some research. And in the comment section below, let me know what you find. Is there one reason, one logical reason why we would ban, all out ban the shipment of animals? It makes absolutely zero sense. So what can we do about it? Is there a solution to all of this? Yes. Just let me rant a little bit more first. So why would somebody want to ban in the first place? Well, you have crazy people who work for crazy lobbyist organizations. Okay, so we're not going to watch the entire thing. No offense, Wiccan, your video is the best. But we are going to watch some of the funnier ones. This is more of him just ranting. What is this? I am not a rabbit. I'm shy. This is a, one of the funny ones that you post. What is this? I am not a rabbit. I am shy. Do it to hide. What is this? This too tough. Not tasty. Ow. 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 I'm gonna try it. Yuck. Wait. Nope. Too much blueberry. Making my tongue blue. Mm. But. Oh, stuff inside is the taste. Oh. To sleep. Pink berry make me tongue pink. Do not climb. I'm not being seen. What? Is there something on my face? No. Still no. What is this? How do I eat this goop? This is high quality H2O. Why do you stare? Privacy, please. Well, this berry is delicious. Follow and subscribe for more awesome animal facts. That was probably the best. I actually never watched this one. Hi, my name is Eris. I'm the security bear. My position is Secretary of Defense. My name is Flutie. I'm the security fox. As head security, I got my weapon chart. This is my paw check. I've got lots of jobs here. I chew sticks mostly. Gotta check all the areas of the property. <laughs> Distract them. It's over there. Gone with my butt. And when you see intruders, you gotta scream at them. Okay, they're gone. Back to my post. What's this? It's just a camera. You gotta track smells. To track smells, you gotta be the smell. We don't work for free. We get paid mostly in butt rubs, but I like butt rubs. I'm very fast. <laughs> Look at my speed. You gotta do big zoomies all over the yard. You gotta keep your speed up. We always dig to China. You have to protect to get the enemies from below as well. To keep our skills sharp, I gotta rough the bear up. Make sure she's on her toes. Gotta take a snow break. Gotta stay hydrated. And at the end of the day, you gotta shake it out. Follow and subscribe for more awesome animals. That was adorable. And his videos. Just his awesome, cute adorables. I love his adorable pets. Um, I never wa watch the streams. No offense, Adam. I just don't have an hour and 29 minutes to spare. That's a lie. But... Ball pythons are called ball pythons because in their native range of West Africa, researchers found that they're very good basketball. That traffic come on. What even exclaimed? Well, my favorite YouTuber told me I can use his content, so I'm going to. No, don't use his content. Use your own. No, I'm going to give him credit because I know what to not do. Wow. That little can really fall okay, out. The a researcher's name is Lavar Ball. Beer dragons often leave dry, crusty it's little bits of their salad that they probably didn't eat. Turns out 
leaves that behind to practice their fire breathing, and that's why it's dry and crispy. Leopard geckos were thought to be called leopard geckos because of this pattern that makes them look like a leopard. It turns out that they actually hunt in packs and can take down full-grown leopards eat them in a single bite. The pits in a ball python's face have nothing to do with finding food. They're called heat pits because they're talented battle rappers and known for spitting hot fire. Blue tongue skinks were thought to have blue tongues to interpreters, but it turns out that their native diet is actually blue jolly ranchers and blue freezies. Check that out. The ball pythons are thought to be head shy to protect themselves, but it turned out they're just speciesist and don't want your dumb mammal hands all over their pretty little face. Follow and subscribe for more awesome animal f Um. So that's all videos I think we're going to show. We'll see what bearded dragons do for fun on the day off or so. I like to start my day by totally completely ignore my salad. It brings joy to my heart. Speaking of time, and why that my tablet gives me. I like to start my day. I really enjoy wearing hats. Some might say that dragons don't wear hats. I like to start my day by totally and completely ignoring my salad. It brings joy to my heart. Thinking of the time and effort that was spent by my salad maker. But I'd rather just poop in the and walk away. I also really enjoy wearing hats. Some might say that dragons don't wear hats, but look at my head. This is a very nice hat. This is my nice hat. I spend most of my day sharpening my claws. I have stone and bricks to encourage the filing of my talons, but that's what my salad maker would want. I want salad? I want blood. I do like to eat them. Not salad. Mostly crickets, even worms, even the occasional baby mouse. Adam, since I know you're going to be watching this video because I'm going to send it to you, you should definitely do a TikTok with the sound, Mother, I Crave Violence. They're stupid. But most of all, I enjoy human ears. Mmm, human ears. Hit subscribe for more fun reptile content. I like to start my day by totally and completely ignoring my... So... That's it, and I'm going to send it to my favorite YouTuber of all time, Leo. Chris and I are going to the store. We're going to be good. Okay. Have fun. Tell Chris she better be good. What do you want? <gasps> what do I want? Finally take me okay. to go to Canada. No. Oh, well, I want to meet my favorite YouTuber. I really don't <laughs> but he's funny um he has a great sense of humor extremely kid friendly he... I'm almost done I'm doing my outro um his videos are hilarious like I just showed you Mom, kid friendly. Good, thank you. Okay, now is. See, oh, that's my screen recorder. What in the what? How did my wallet come with me? So yeah. Okay, thanks. Let me see my wallet. So now it's the my end. Um, Leo says bye, and he also says he wants to crawl on Mike. So that's what he's gonna do. Do you hear his tiny little feet steps? Um, if I can hit 12 subscribers, I'll do a reading comments video. I and I morning, will. And I'll read the comments, Adam. When you're done watching it, it's going to be up on the internet, most likely. So please make a comment. I'll read it, most definitely. Um, and credit. Thanks to Adam Wicken.
give him a thumbs up for appreciation. Oh. Thumbs up. Where did all that come from? The mom put her wallet on Andy her bed. No, I don't think so. If it is, it's in her jacket pocket. Right there. Why are you going through my stuff? Because I'm looking for mom's wallet. I sent him a thumbs up. Okay. And. Stop. Stop. If I can get 12 subscribers, I'll make the reading comments video. If I get 10, I'll make a part two of the reptiles to keep in my area. And maybe it'll be a bonus. Oh, you know what? I left